गुड मॉर्निंग स्टूडेंट्स वेलकम टू योर इंग्लिश क्लास टू चिल्ड्रेन इन इंग्लिश क्लास लेसन नंबर ट्वेल्व ऑल अबाउट डॉल्फिन्स यू रेड द लेसन एंड लर्न अबाउट डॉल्फिन्स एंड डॉल्फिन्स आर नॉट फिश दे लुक लाइक फिश बट दे आर नॉट फिश बिकॉज दे कैन नॉट ब्रीथ अंडर वाटर दे हैव कम ऑन द सर्फेस ऑफ द वाटर टू ब्रीथ एंड दे हैव अ होल ब्लो होल ऑन द टॉप ऑफ द हेड फ्रॉम दैट दे ब्रीथ एंड देन दे डोंट हैव अव हेयर दिस Skin is smooth and shiny, and uh, they have fins. They swim with their bow fins, and they are very friendly with human beings. They are friendly. They play with humans, with human beings. And when uh, there is a boat in the sea, they live in the deep sea, deep water of the sea, ocean. When the boat is in the ocean, they come around the boat, and they are friendly with human. They and the face looks smiling smiling it looks at they are smiling so dolphins are very friendly to human beings and they are not afraid of human beings they have teeth but they are use them only to catch their food not to chew their food okay then they have ears also and they can see at night also like cats and dogs and they can they talk to each other they talk to their group with the help of whistles clicks or squeals and they sleep with one eye open okay and they play they play chess and they jump high over the waves and they play and their face looks smiling okay children today we will do the exercise in the book so take out your books page number 95 will do the exercises in the book english book take out your english book okay children we'll continue with the vocabulary exercises in the book page number 96 b1 look at these pictures and write the names of these animals that live in water first is what is this star fish star star f i s h fish this is shark s h a r k shark okay next is whale w h a l e whale number 4 is octopus o c t o p u s octopus crab c r a b crab tortoise t o r t o i s e tortoise pronunciation is tortoise okay children now you can see b2 search for the names of these water bodies in the puzzle first is c where is c okay where is sea find it out ha huh? s e a c lake where is lake find it in the puzzle this is your homework okay then pond p o n d pond find these water bodies in this word puzzle ocean stream find this in the puzzle for example pond is here okay find the other words and circle them okay Okay, children. Now, children, as we have learned the names of water animals, I will show their pictures also once more. This is a starfish. This is an octopus. This is a blue whale. Yes. Then this is a tortoise. This is a tortoise. This is a fish. This is a crab. Yes. Then this is a sea horse. and this is a dolphin yes so can you see this these water animals yes these are the water animals that we have learnt in the book also so children yes here you have to write which is the largest water body water body means the area of water largest biggest is ocean o c e n ocean is the largest water body and second is which one is the smallest water body it is a pond pond is the smallest water body okay now children grammar exercise c1 compare the sentences in pink clouds with those in orange clouds these are pink clouds and these are orange clouds so we will read and we will see what is the difference name is my packy then in orange box my name is packy so this sentence looks very confusing so it is wrong it is a 
not as it is not a sentence this is a correct sentence it is a meaningful sentence my name is pecky my name is pecky but a i am it looks very confusing it is not a complete sentence i am a bird is a complete meaningful sentence next is i live next in a it also it is also a confusing sentence it is not a sentence i live in a nest it makes sense so it is a sentence it is a sentence now favorite my fruits are food this is confusing so it is not a sentence fruits are my favorite food it is a meaningful sentence now here you have to circle the correct answer okay correct answer the sentences talk about pecky the bird the meaning of sentences in pink or orange clouds is clear so in the orange cloud the meaning is clear so you will circle orange the first letter of the sentences in orange cloud is always in capital letters so when we write start writing the uh, sentence we always start writing with a capital cursive letter so capital will be circled the sentences in orange clouds always end with a full stop so at the end of a sentence there is always a full stop so circle full stop so we have learned a sentence is a group of words that has a meaning we have done this before also this is the revision so a sentence is a group of words that has a meaning each sentence begins with a capital letter and ends with a full stop okay so you have to learn this okay now here there is an exercise see to tick write the words that make a sentence first sentence ravi was going to delhi on monday now first letter is small here so it is wrong okay there is no full stop at the end so we will put a cross because it is not a complete correct sentence second my mother learned to speak french when she went to paris so first letter is capital cursive and french a proper noun is written with capital cursive and paris is also a proper noun so it is a written with uh, capital letter so it is a correct sentence meaningful and correct sentence third i am going to see a movie on tuesday so first letter is capital and at the end full stop is put so it is a correct sentence number 4 mickey mouse cartoon is favorite my so it is wrong put a cross small letter and no full stop and it is confusing johnny's birthday so first letter is small it means it is wrong so put a cross okay children now children in the pronunciation part we will learn the sound of cl and cr okay we will learn the sound of cl or and cr okay so here you can see the pictures you have to pick out the names starting with cl in the yellow box write in the yellow box and the word starting with cr write in the purple box okay then first is crab c r a b crab so it will be written in this pink, uh, purple box c r a b crab write down clown c l o w n clown so write in the yellow box c l o w n clown crab write in the purple box c r o c o crocodile crocodile crow c r o w crow purple box cloud yellow box c l o u d cloud clock write in the yellow box c l o c k clock okay so children write neatly and learn good children we'll do more exercises in our next class okay have a nice day